here are 10 tips in After Effects to make your work faster and save you a lot of time. Number one is set work area to selection. For this example, we will select all the layers by hitting Ctrl A and hit Ctrl Alt plus B to set the work area. And I'm going to go to the very top, right click and trim comp to work area. All right, number two is copy with property link. So let's say for example, I want this layer, single layer to control the rotation properties of all the other layers. So make sure you select these properties, not the layers. Go to edit, copy with property links or control all plus C. Go and select all the other layers and paste it. All right, number three is paste at current time. For this example, I'll select the layer, go to edit, copy and move your current time indicator and hit Control alt and v to paste in at current time number four is center anchor point which i've always covered in my tutorials all right for this example let's draw a rectangle and i want this anchor point in the center of the shape how do i do it it's pretty simple go to layer transform and center anchor point in layer content all right, number four is related to anchor point, which is center anchor point in new shape layer. So we're gonna fix this issue. So let's say you create a rectangular shape or any shape. By default, you can see the anchor point is not in the center of our shape. To fix this, go to edit, preferences, click on general and in there, check the center anchor point in new shape layers and hit OK. Now, the next time you draw any shape, you will have the anchor point at the center always. All right, number six is open shape and mass path. So let's say you draw a path using a pen tool and then you close the path. And then how do you open it? Just select both these points, right click on one of them and then go to mask and shape path and uncheck this closed. Once you do that, it's gonna open them up then select the point and you can continue drawing once you're done you can close the path and you have the path shape path all right coming at number seven locate project files for this example i have this simple project we're gonna render this by hitting ctrl m on the keyboard click on the output modules settings and make sure you check the include project link and render the file and then we're gonna import that file inside the first project. Select the file, go to edit and select edit original. When you do that, it's gonna open the original project file that it was created in. Coming at number eight is collect assets from the project panel of After Effects. So let's say you have a project that includes assets from different locations of your hard drive and saving and finding the assets from your hard drive from different locations and moving them inside one single folder will be really time consuming and really pain. So here's how we can save the project and all the assets inside one single folder. Go to file, dependencies, remove unused footage and go to file again, dependencies again, this time click the collect files. After Effects will ask you to save the project file click on save and click this collect and navigate where you want to save it once you save it after effects will copy all the assets from different locations of your hard drive and put them together in one single folder where you saved it including the project file all right coming at number nine is shift parenting behavior so the way this works is if you hold down shift and if you parent pick quick from your logo to any of this null, it will move your logo to whatever layer you are parenting to. All right, coming at number 10 is look at selected 3D layers. So for this example, I have three different texts, which is in 3D space and a camera. And then we're gonna select our first 3D text, go to view, look at selected layers, then we're gonna use the orbit tool of the camera by hitting C on the keyboard to reframe it. Move the time indicator forward, select the next text again, go to view, I'll do the same, look at selected layers, move the time indicator, select all the layers, go to view. This time we're gonna select 
look at all layers, use the orbit tool to reframe it again. If you want more After Effects tutorials, you can watch it here. This is Motion Designer and I'll see you in the next one. <laughs>